So this review is going to be pretty short because there's not much I can really say about this movie in as far as reviewing goes. It's more of a recommendation. I continue with my review. This one's not really a coming of age film. Kind of is, but it just pretty much just takes place in one day. And everyone knows if you haven't heard of this, don't know where you've been. I don't have it on DVD, but I happen to have it on VHS. See, you can hear it. You can hear the movie. Today I'm reviewing Ferris Bueller's Day Off, starring Matthew Broderick as Ferris. Yeah, yeah, it's a 17-year-old, he's in his senior year in high school, and uh, he finally decides to do what he's been wanting to do for a while. He's going to cut class for the day with his girlfriend and his best friend. They're just going to cut class, and Matthew Broderick plays a pretty, uh, pretty sneaky kid, so he manages to get his girlfriend and uh, best friend at school. And then they go on an adventure in downtown Chicago and just live it up. But of course, what would a movie be without trouble and uh, just getting into trouble and problems coming across, coming across problems? You know what I'm talking about. But Matthew Broderick and his buddies, they get into some trouble. Some, uh, some mistakes are made and then they have to solve those problems because that's what a movie's about. you got to have a dilemma in a movie, otherwise what's the movie going to be? Ten minutes of having fun and then the movie's over. But yeah, check this movie out. It's from 1986. As you can tell, Matthew Broderick looks quite young here. If you see him now, he's very, quite old looking. That's beside the point. Check this movie out. I'm sure you can get it on DVD because VHS is just so old. Like, how many of you even have a VCR anymore? Really? Really? Fun fact for this film. The guy who played Principal Rooney, Jeffrey Jones, he's actually now a registered sex offender. He actually has been for a little while, but uh, recently he kind of didn't show up for court to re, -re no, he didn't re-register as a sex offender, and then he got hunted down and got fined and all sorts of crap. But yeah, he's a he's a creepy dude, creepy dude. Anyways, that's all for this review. I know it wasn't of a review, it was just a recommendation. I like doing that because I don't really review. I'm not gonna recommend movies I don't like. There's no point in it. It's not really reviews, just recommendations. I really wish this channel was called The Daily Movie Recommend... Recommenders? Does that make sense? Not really. So anyways, check it out. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. See you next week.